How to dress your triangle shaped body type. Hi ladies, it's Erin and welcome back to my channel. My mission through my channel is to make style simple. I know you're busy, I know you're juggling a lot of things. It's easy to put this on the back burner, but it is so important because when you look good, you feel good. You're a better mom, wife, sister, friend, etc. One of the key components to making sure that you look your best each and every day is figuring out what your body type is and then dressing in a way that fits and flatters your body type. Never dress for trends, always dress for you. Your body type, what fits and flatters you. Today's body type is the triangle shape that's also referred to often as the pear shape. I just have to prefer shapes instead of fruits. <laughs> Basically what the triangle shape means is that your hip measurement is larger than your bust or your shoulders, typically around 5% larger. So visually your upper body is smaller and your hips, butt and thighs are larger. So I like to give you a visual reference, somebody that you can Google image search and pull up a lot of different outfit combinations just so you can refer back to it, create a Pinterest board so that you have that outfit inspiration at the ready. Your celebrity inspiration could be from Jennifer Lopez, she is a triangle shape body type. Also Beyonce, Beyonce gorgeous triangle body shape. So what do you do to create that visual proportion and balance if you have the triangle body shape? Well, since your lower body is the larger half of your body and you let's say in theory, want to create that visual proportion and balance. Maybe you don't. And if you don't, then do the opposite of what I'm saying. But if you do, you're going to want to minimize the lower half and maximize the upper body. How do you do that? So you put the dark colors on the lower body. You put vertical stripes on the lower body. You wear full flared and A-line skirts and dresses on the lower body. You do boot cut, flared, wide leg pants and jeans on the lower body to create that visual balance. In contrast, on the upper body, that's where you have the fun, where you add the volume, where you add the color, you add the prints, you add the sparkle, you add the shoulder details that will really elongate and add width across the shoulders and create that visual balance like puff shoulders, shoulder pads, structure shoulders, off shoulder tops. You also can play around with necklines and wearing dramatic necklines. Jewelry will draw the eye up and add volume at the top. So just really thinking about your body in terms of how can I maximize my assets and how can I minimize the problem areas and also so how can I create that visual proportion and visual balance? If the upper body is smaller and the lower body is larger, you want to make the upper body look a little larger and the lower body a little smaller. And that's how you do it. Those are the tricks. That's it. If you guys missed my video about how to determine your body type or how to take your measurements to determine your body type, I will put a link to that video below in the description box. And also right here, you can click on it and watch it. Would you like to see outfit ideas for the triangle shaped body? Please let me know that below in the comments. I would love to know your thoughts about that. If you have more specific pointed style questions, don't forget I did start a private Facebook community membership based site that that will enable you to ask all of those style questions and get immediate answers from both your peers and me and my team. You might wanna look into that. I'll put a link to the Busby Style Hive below. If you like this video and you wanna see more like it, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.